Hey guys, so today I have a video for you guys. It's a what's in my bag video. And let's get started. So first off, this is my purse. Um, I did get it at Target. And it just looks like this in the back. And on the side, there are two little zippers. Um, I got this bag at Target um, for my birthday about four months ago. And it was, I believe, $40, I want to say. It was a good deal, minus the fact I think it's because I'm carrying too much stuff. It is starting to rip in the inside right here. The little um, things poking out. But other than that, it's, it's a great purse. Um, and I love it so much. So let's find out what's in my bag. I haven't cleaned this out in forever. I normally clean out my bag about, I would say, once a month. And I have not cleaned this out for like two months. It's bad. So we'll start with the front pocket. pocket. I don't think anything's in here, but we'll check. No, there's nothing in there at all. So, we'll move on to the inside pocket, which is completely full. The first thing I see is my phone. I have an iPhone 6 that I got through my work. I work for a cell phone company. Um, and I absolutely love it. I love iPhones. They're my favorite um, type of phone ever. The second thing I have is my wallet, which... Um, Ciao Bella XO on YouTube actually got this at TJ Maxx. She inspired me to get it. I've been looking for a bigger wallet for a while. It actually was a um, crossbody bag that had a chain that went around it so it could be a crossbody. Um, she did the same thing. She took the chain off and made it into a wallet. It is literally huge and I mean huge um there's one two three four five compartments um the first one and I didn't even know and the inside is leopard print and the outside's leopard print and leopard print is my favorite I love it um, so, and then there's a pocket out here too, which I don't have anything in it. Normally when I do just make like a quick, quick errand to like Walmart or Target, sometimes I just take my wallet and I stick my phone right there and it's super handy and you can just carry it around. But that's if I'm not feeling like taking my full purse with me. Um, in the first compartment in my wallet, I have coupons for... And I have $10. I didn't know that was in there. Um, I have a coupon for 50 cents off any drink for Dutch Bros, which is a local coffee place we have in my hometown or in my state. It's everywhere. Um, and then I have the Human Bean, which is another local coffee spot. The Black Rock, which is only found in Portland, which is three hours away from me. Bath and Body Works. All of these are Bath and Body Works. That's in the first compartment. In the second one, I don't have anything in. The third one, I have a Dutch Bros card, a Starbucks card, my school ID, which you're not going to see the picture because it's horrible. Um, I have some bank cards. I have two stamp cards for Dutch Bros. Um, the next one is the change pocket, which I have some change. I don't normally like keeping change in my purse. I do like putting it in um, a change jar I have. So I'm just going to take that out. Um, and then I have $5 to spend. And then I have my driver's license in here, my insurance card for my car, a Costco card, a Safeway card. Um, an American Eagle Rewards card, and a movie theater rewards card, and a library card, which I never go to the library anyways, but, and then I have a ton of receipts, like 
Come on now. <laughs> so I need to take these out and file those. I do keep most of my receipts just so I know what I spend monthly. So that was what's in my wallet. The next thing I have in here is a water bottle. This was from work last night. Um, I normally drink water. I talk on the phone eight hours a day for a call center and I drink water regularly. Um, so yeah, that's in there. I have a pack of five gum in a scent. I have a card from my school letting me know I have an advising appointment for my classes. I have a bill. I have three bills in here. Power bill, a cable bill. These should probably be taken out of my purse. And then I have a Costco coupon. I normally just throw my mail in my purse. Um, I have a bank um, mailing card. I have a receipt for 7-Eleven. I have a, I don't even know why they sent me this, but I have a CenturyLink internet telling me to sign up for them, but I have some training, so I don't, I don't understand. And then I keep this notebook in my purse. Um, I mainly keep it in there for while I'm at work, like I can write down like how much I get paid for the week or the month or every other two weeks. We could check how much our paycheck's gonna be a couple days before it comes out. So normally when that happens, I put how much I've made, how much has to go towards rent. I'm really organized. I also have a couple things in here for like videos I want to do. Um, overtime, if I want to work overtime. Some makeup things that I want to get. Um, I have, we're going to see Ed Sheeran in June. Um, so I have a planning schedule for Ed Sheeran, how much I need to save for the trip. And yeah, so I keep that in here just to jot some notes down at work if I need to remember to do something. And then I have a coin purse and Anthony got this for me for my birthday or for Christmas. I can't remember. It's super cute because it does match my purse. And I didn't plan it that way because I had a different purse before, but I do like black and gold a lot for purses and things like that. So that's in there. And then I have headphones, I have a Starburst Fave Reds, these are my favorite. It comes with watermelon, which I love watermelon anything, but then it also comes with fruit punch, which is really good too. And then the basic strawberry and cherry, which I'm not a big fan of, but whatever. And then I have a charging port, um, I love these, I haven't, I've only used it once and um, I absolutely love it. You just bring your charger with you and you charge it. It already has a full charge for your iPhone or any phone you have. I got this at Walmart and it's leopard print and it's super cute and I love it. And then I, and then I have this charging port for this um, to just plug it in and charge it if I need to. And then... I have my mail key and in my apartment complex we have like a gym or a place where you can rent books. So I have the key to get into that. Gum wrappers. And then I have my little badge to um, get into my work. Um, the front doors of my work. And then I have... Burt's Bees Chapstick. This one is the Nourishing Lip Balm with Mango Butter. And then, and then I have an Oreo. Well, not like a, like a pack of an Oreo. Two Oreos and a mint. We had an all-in-play meeting last Monday. Or like the Monday before I'm filming today, which is Saturday. Uh, 
We had an all employee meeting lunch, which was like two hours, and they gave us Oreos. Well, they gave us a sandwich, an apple, Oreos, a bag of chips, and a mint. And I didn't eat the Oreos or the mint, so I just threw them in my purse. <laughs> and then I have a business card for iRoot Electronics. I am not too happy with them. They still have um, Anthony's phone, and it's been like a month and a half, and they have not fixed it yet. I have a bag of M&M's, which have been in there forever. A empty pack of gum, the same gum from before. And then I have the last thing. Well, there's one more thing in here. Oh, you scared me, lady. And the last thing I have in here is my, it's not really a makeup bag, I wouldn't say. It's more of an all-purpose, I need these when I'm out and about. I got this bag at Victoria's Secret. It actually came with a um, Christmas present I got. And it came with the Love Spell collection. No, not the Love Spell. The Pure Seduction collection. And I love it. It's my favorite Victoria's Secret perfume. But it's super cute. Tan and pink and white. But in here, I have hand sanitizer. Can't go wrong with hand sanitizer. I have hemp's pomegranate. Herbal Body Moisturizer. This stuff smells divine. Anthony's mom got this for me for Christmas about two years ago. Was it two years ago? Yeah, it was two years ago. And it smells amazing. And then I have a pink chiffon. Um, hand sanitizer. And this is actually empty, so that's going to be thrown away. <laughs> I have Kleenex. I have Excedrin Migraine because talking on the phone with customers gives me a headache. So I need this all the time. And then I have Lotion Jurgens Ultra Healing Extra Dry Skin Lotion. And this thing has been through hell and back. But I actually don't really like this lotion. It smells weird. And it makes my hands feel really, really oily, and I don't like the feeling of it. Um, and then I have eye drops. And then I have a concealer stick, which I don't even know why this got in here. It kind of looks like lipstick, but it is a concealer stick from Rimmel London. And what color? Soft honey. And then I have an inhaler. I do have um, anxiety sometimes and panic attacks so I do have to have an inhaler with me at all times just in case. And then I have dental floss. <laughs> A pen. I don't know where that came from. And then I have Tylenol. Um, for any like leg cramps or anything like that um a hair tie and then a ton of cough drops and that's all i have in there and the last thing i don't have anything in these side pockets and the last thing i have in my purse and there's like a little pocket right here and if any of you guys were wondering, the brand of this purse is Mar Marona. Make sure I don't knock over the camera. Marona. Ooh. And the last thing I have in my purse is a... What's this called? Mace. Um, my boyfriend wanted me to get this just in case. Because uh, I do work late. I get off. Well, it's not too late, but I get off at 8, and sometimes in the winter, well, of course in the winter, it is dark by the time I get off. And sometimes either you can be on a long call or work overtime, and you're the last one leaving, or you are the first one leaving because you get off call early. So he wanted me to have this just for my protection um, in case anything happens. I've never used this before, but it has like a safety feature. Where if I did need to use it, which I'm not going to, oh, um, you'd have to lift this up first. Um, it's a safety feature, so if this is not lift up, you cannot press the button so you don't spray yourself in the eye. 
So that's the safety feature of it. He thought it was better than the other ones. But that is everything that I have in my purse. Um, thanks so much for watching. Thanks so much for watching my previous videos. Or my previous video. This is going to be the second one I'm uploading. And I do have a lot more in store for you guys. And thanks so much for watching. See you next time. Bye.